Hey there, it's Henry Heem from Henry Heem Marketing here, making this quick video today to give you a quick rundown on how to create ad images very simply on canva.com. You don't need to hire an expensive designer, it doesn't need to take you ages. You can create adequate and actually very good images on canva.com that look professionally created. You can um, run your ads in a matter of minutes sometimes and it will have the effect that you want it to have. People will opt into your offer just using this free tool I'm going to walk you through. So. Um, let's uh, see here what are the benefits of Canva first of all it's easy to use um, quick to understand you don't need any experience after going through a video like this for example you should be able to straight away start creating your ads on Canva it's what I use a lot of the time and you will have similar um, a similar outcome if you do use it you do have the right dimensions as well on Canva you can choose between running a standard Facebook post in terms of dimensions uh, proper um, dimensions for Facebook ads you can pick between those it's also very customizable and as I said before it gets you your ads done very quickly without a lot of time consumed which is fairly important for you as a business owner watching this so um, what what to keep in mind when creating images on Canva if you need stock images I like to go to unsplash.com they've got very high quality um, stock images on there or just find a similar website I've also got to to note on, on the uh, note of stock images, in many cases you, you don't want to actually use stock images because Facebook um, sort of prefers, or people on Facebook prefer more natural looking images, more casual or candid images, so a lot of the time stock images look too too stale sort of and they, don't, they aren't good for, for Facebook ads, so you want to find any random image that you've got in your business, say you are a gym, any random image that somebody from your, your gym has, has taken or you've taken some shots around your gym you could use those um, another thing to note when creating your images is you want to make sure there's contrast in the images between the text and the call to action offer that you do have you don't want it to blend in or it doesn't stand out on um, a Facebook uh, newsfeed the average uh, attention span of, of people these days is around like nine seconds I've seen uh, in various places so you obviously do have to catch people's attention quickly if they're going to opt into your offer or take the action that you want them to take so keep those in mind when creating your images now I'm going to walk you through exa my exact process that I use let's see here okay so firstly you want to go to canva.com obviously just type that into your your browser and let's see hopefully this doesn't take too long of a time to open up and we can quickly show you the example and show you how to to uh, create images on Canva. So okay, so it's loaded up here. Let's just give it a few more seconds so it doesn't freeze. Um, you can see the things here. Create a design. Yes, that's what we want to do. You can either use custom dimensions if you want to, or go for like a Facebook post, a social media post, and so on. In general, a social media post or Facebook post can and should be good enough to run an ad. Sometimes even better because it's it's bigger it, it stands out a bit more on, on a newsfeed but in this example here we're going to use a proper dimensions for a traditional Facebook ad post um, first of all we've got to find it here hopefully I find it quick enough for the sake of this video here we go ads so we want to of course go for Facebook ad it's going to give us the exact dimensions that we need to to run a Facebook ad uh, yeah and very very simply so let's again wait for this to load give it a few seconds and then we should be good to roll yep it's coming up here so as you can see you can choose from a template on on Canva you can go with one of these standard templates and just replace it with uh, something that relates to your offer your niche or whatever we can just change this text here and create a buy my stuff or, or whatever you, you can just do it like that obviously that's a not a great ad but uh, let's delete that we're going to create a, a custom ad for this example firstly I've got to get rid of this okay there we go so I'm going to go here now in this example let's say we're creating something for a gym I'm going to type in gym workout here say you own a gym you want to run Facebook ads for the gym to get people to opt in this is how you do it so let's say you just go to google type in gym workout or whatever to find a 
relevant image that we could use to run ads to. I'm not going to track my time. And um, let's see which, which image here looks good that we could use. Ba ba ba. This could be good. Let's go with this one. There's a little bit of contrast which I like in this. Uh, let's see. So what we're going to do is drag this image to our Canva. Uh, you insert it in here. It should come up. Da, 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 da. Let's try again to make sure it's coming out. Do, do. Nope, it doesn't seem to be working. So, okay, say I'm just going to use this uh, post here for the sake of the example. Going to use this post here and pretend we are uh, you are running ads for a children's playground or, or whatever. This, say, say we're running ads for a children's school here. Um, so you can go to the side here to get some elements to use for the ad. What you want to do in many cases, have something like this with uh, your offer in it. So do, 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 do. let's make this, uh, we can just make this white. There we go. And then what we want to then do is get some text, put the text in here, da, da, da. let's go. Um, what's, what would be a good opt-in offer or a bait for people looking to go to a, um, people trying to send their kids to a kindergarten or anything like that, what might be a good offer? You need to, to think of that when you're crafting your offer and then insert that into your ad image. Now I can't think of anything great off the top of my head, so the example I'm going for won't be the best, but let's just assume um, uh, bring your kids for free. Bring your kids for free. Um, okay, so say, say we're going to go with this. Let's first make the uh, image or the, 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 the color red so it stands out on the news uh, feed. So <clears throat> see we've in this example we've already got uh, ad image ready to run on Facebook. Very simply it's taking me less than five minutes. You've got it here with your offer that would grab people's attention. Um, I haven't thought of the, the bait properly yet but just as an example you can go with something like this. There's a nice image of a, a smiling child. It's something that will grab attention on the newsfeed and you can get ready to run your ads. So hope that helped. Hope you understood how to use Canva to create very simple images in a matter of minutes a lot of the time and ready to run your ads. In another video, I'll walk you through exactly how I will then run ads and uh, get successful ads. But hope this helped. If you enjoyed the sort of content and content on Facebook ads, and marketing tips please send me a comment comment sorry let me know what you think and subscribe for more free videos like this